Well, we're going to the gym. Today, I think we're gonna film the workout. What do you think, Day? Film today's workout. We'll do a little voiceover, explain what we're doing. Sure. Benjamin, we're going to the gym, bud. You wanna come lift weights? You wanna come lift weights, Ben? No? Just gonna eat our grass? All right, dude. Get we'll, shredded. We'll be back, all right? Rub before I go. One more face rub before I go. I miss you, man. Oh, yeah, stretch it out. Ooh, weightlifting. Look at you lifting weights. Look at us warming up like real people. So, um, both of us have not been lifting. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck we're doing recently, but we're not been lifting. So, um, well, I know what's wrong with me. Yeah, you're injured. Um, I'm just getting back into it now, and of course, I'm sore. So, we decided to really take our time and warm up our shoulders, and we're gonna start doing. Um, look at you. You look like you're in a textbook. Yeah. This yeah. Is, this is how you warm up. Warm um, up harder than us. I'm so focused. Dude, look at the cut in the new hoodie. Doesn't look so good. It makes me look like I still lift weights. You do, look, you're lifting weights. I know, look at me. It's because of the cut of the hoodie. Um, so how many sets of this do we do? Shit, five? Uh, yeah, back and forth. We, we really, At least really, four times. We really, really took our time um, warming up our shoulders. Now the plan was, what was the plan? The plan was I was gonna... I Kaya, don't know what you're... <laughs> Kaya, chill out with the water drinking, bro. We're trying to record some voice over here. Hey. Kaya. Jeez, man. Um, so what was the plan? I don't think... I knew my plan. Because I ended up, after I warmed up my shoulders so much, I was going to warm up my shoulders. And I Your think, plan was to do a little bit of shoulders, some leg. I remember you, you were doing... Yeah, no, I was, I was going to squat that day. You were going to squat, do some shoulders, and... Like, well, I was going to warm up my shoulders, because I want to start doing this every day, and then I was going to squat. Ah. And unfortunately, I think after I did this, my shoulders felt pretty good. Because after this, we went into the uh, the well, side raises. Yeah, we did some angled side raises with your pinky, like, completely And upward. super light. Look, you yeah. still fucking lift. Jesus, oh, why do you yeah. look like that? Because I'm awesome. Ugh, I look like a sloppy disaster. Look at that delt right there. I know, you're doing really good. So Pumpkin delt. Um, <laughs> gee, why, why, why do you look like that? So after this, um, I think I was just in the mood to train shoulders. I think that uh, it w the, the gym wasn't too crowded. I'm used to the gym being fucking packed. I'm used to everyone talking to me and asking me questions and telling me things that are wrong with the gym and things that we should get. And it just actually makes it hard to work out. But as you can see, it's like mid Sunday morning right now and it's empty. Yeah. I guess there was a pop in the morning and then a pop at night. So. I'm going super light here, really trying to focus on the shoulder. And really over-exaggerating the pinky up, which focuses on your medial head a lot more. All oh, those striations. Yeah. So I'm trying to look like her. Um, but yeah, we did what? Another maybe five or six sets of this? Yeah, we did. We went heavy in this. Yeah. I mean, heavy in the sets. We went, we never... Well, why, why are you zooming in on my face? I'm just fucking with you. I, I do what I want. So after this, I was like, I don't know, let's just do some casual front raises. So this is a front raise I like to do. Oh, I must have caught you at the end of the set. Well, you, I did. You're exhausted. Yeah. Well, I'm doing a, a little bit of back and shoulders today. So I love, I love putting like two body groups together. So I was doing back and shoulders. Not me. Not I'm just you. doing shoulders. You're just doing one thing at a time. So uh, I, I've always liked this as a front raise. Um, I actually engage my traps a lot, and uh, it's just a good motion. And if you work on the D cell and you don't actually let it like swing back towards you, uh, of course I've been wearing a belt the whole time because oh, my shoes. because my fucking back hurts. I don't even know where I got those shoes. They've just been in my closet for oh, years. Oh, what a fancy pants! I was dancing. Um, but if you really work on the negative, like the D cell of this exercise, uh, it's it's really really good. Um, so this is, this is in my head right now, I'm still doing legs, but I was sort of like, I don't know, shoulders are feeling really good. Um, yeah, and then so this is part of my, I think I did three exercises here. So I'm doing rear delt flies, and then I'm gonna go to the lat pull down and actually do face pulls. And then I'm going to that front raise. 
So this is like your big tri set. Yeah. I just filmed it all segmented and shit. Yeah. yeah. You just missed the whole first part. So the, I started with this, hit the rear delts, hit a little back and rear delts with this next exercise. I like doing it at a lat pull down because you don't have to brace yourself. Like if you can do it in between the cables, but this way, as long as you, you angle your back or angle your body a little bit back further and just pull towards your face. So it's a little back and some rear delts. Jeez. Not bad. Can we just take a minute and, and would you look at that? Would you look at that? You look really good. Thanks. Um, so that was exercise number two. And then I'll go to the front raise. And then you go to the front raise. You look enormous. Well. I, I look I, like a ninja. I did take a very rounded scoop of STW. And uh, I mean, so do I, this is definitely like I just don't respond as well. Bodybuilder style today. Um, I was trying to get ready for a powerlifting meet, sprained my wrists, um, so I can't put a whole lot of weight in it. Um, I have to eat some Advil before I train. That's not good. And I usually wear a brace anytime it's any like pushing movements. Um, squats hurt it a lot. I can't grip the weight as good. But as long as I keep it sort of light, I'm okay. Which bodybuilding you can keep it sort of light? Uh, my doctor do not tell him. He would not appreciate it. Well, what if your doctor sees this video? Uh, and now I'm just doing full blown shoulders. Shoulders. I am doing shoulders. You're in I'm, it. I'm doing lateral raises. I forgot about legs. Um, and I'm just, I'm in my happy place now. Um, I mean, you have to, and that's how I've always trained is you just have to feel it. It's all an emotional basis for me. Um, there's sometimes there's no rules, there's no science. It's just whatever feels good, you just go with it. And now mm. you're doing more front. And raises. I'm doing front raises. Yeah. I'm just a sh I'm shoulder man. <laughs> I'm just doing all the shoulders. No, but this is like for some reason I just got in the zone and I was like, fuck, man, do I really want to? fuck up my little mojo here and start doing something else or do I just want to continue shoulders? Because realistically, like that's, this is the second time I've lifted all week and it's Sunday, so it's the last day. Yeah. Now tomorrow, I'm gonna lift a lot more and I'm going to impress you because I'm gonna start my deadlift and my bench uh, little finger finger row. Uh, I'm gonna squat on Tuesday. Just Tuesday? Yeah, I'm gonna squat Tuesdays and Thursdays. Oh. Um, look at you. Up. Oh. No, I'm doing side laterals. Okay. So I'm sucking you into my shoulder world. No. This yeah, is I am. Look at you. You're going to be doing back and stuff. And I'm like, yeah, ooh. Back and shoulders. Come over here with me, baby. I'm doing lateral raises. You're standing. Oh, everyone always smash it on your form here. Because you really, uh, you sort of move a little bit. And you keep them in front. Um, but I've never seen you do any other than, I guess, upright rows. Any trap exercises. And this is where I 100 million percent think you get your traps from oh, yeah is these heavy lateral raises i mean you're doing a drop set now and those are in kilos so if you see like a 10 it's really a 22 if you see a, a 25 it's really like a 55 um math but that's where you get your traps look at those traps you know what i mean like you've only done lateral raises and rear delts and your traps are fucking exploded oh this is where you try to do your your shoulder press and you realize how much your hand hurt and then you're like, wow, I'm really, really stupid for trying to do that. Yeah, it was dumb. Um, so these straps, we actually got them made for uh, Warhouse Gym. So they're available on the warhousegym.com. And we also got Run Everything ones, which I think we're going to start doing in promotions. Um, so if you keep an eye on Run Everything, you can purchase them. We kept them really cheap. Uh, they're very inexpensive. Mm -hmm. Cheap makes them sound like they're going to fall apart. Inexpensive makes them sound like, uh, like you get affordable. They're very affordable. Yeah, they they're affordable. Jeez, all the marketing words. Um, so now we're just going to do some standing presses. Uh, I, I really enjoy standing presses. Um, one thing that I, I didn't realize until like two years ago was I had to lock my glutes on standing presses. Hmm? I've always just let them flop around like a, <laughs> like a stripper. Like a, yeah, like yeah. a big booty stripper. I just stand there and I just <laughs> press things. And I never once like tightened my core or fucking squeezed my glutes. And then like when I started tightening my core, it just didn't feel right. And then one day someone was like, bro, tighten that ass up. And I started to squeeze my ass and I got like twice as strong. Yeah. Really mind blowing shit. Big, I'm like a real weightlifter. Big booty Rob Bailey. My booty's not that big. 
It's just my hamstrings are so small. It makes my booty look bigger. Yeah. All so, right. Ooh, you're doing, are you doing superset here? Yeah. What's going on? Yeah. So you missed the other part of my superset in the video. I was focused on, well, look I at, did, I'm filming your butt. I did <laughs> side laterals with the seated uh, cable row. And then I'm doing the presses with front pull downs. And then I drop set and I do behind the head pull downs after this. And just look at them muscles. You're doing good. Yeah. So a lot of times I missed all your big supersets because I was actually training. Yeah. You know, That's sometimes right. I actually train. Yeah. The gym looks like it's filling up a little bit. It looks like we got some more people in here. It's probably because we Snapchat that we're here. So. No. <laughs> no. Ooh, I know what happened mid this workout. Why we're missing a lot of the footage is because we live streamed on your Facebook page. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's what happened. That's we, right. We went into live stream mode. And then we stopped. Anyway, I was oh. really impressed right now. Dana's knocking stuff off the table like an idiot. Um, I was really impressed right here. Look at, look at, look. Like, so much mass. Yeah. Uh, the peaks and valleys. You look like the Rocky Mountains. Look at them. Look at them lats. You're really, really impressive, Dana. I'm just doing a little drop set, I guess, here. You're just, always doing drop sets. Just but this is it. This is all I filmed. Volume. This is all I filmed. After this, I don't remember what we did, I, but, you know? Yeah, I think we live streamed. Oh, we went to live stream right there, so check our Facebook page. Yeah, you can go back I'm and up see when it. the sun comes up. I never can sleep. So Dana plays in an adult soccer league um, for women, which is where I'm at right now. I come here a lot. Um, it's fun to watch her. It's fun to watch her uh, play sports again, do athletic things other than be a bodybuilder. Um, and one of my little secrets is what I do when I get here is a little snack bar back there that no one goes to, and they make really, really good crepes. So I eat crepes while I'm here. Deal with it. I'm showing everybody my food. Cool. <laughs> These are my friends. They make my food whenever I come here. I eat crepes. Yes. Thank you guys. when the sun comes up. Oh, never sleep. I'm staring at the stars at night. And the stars are staring back at me. woman I scored the first two goals I had a head head ball goal I think that was the first in my life it was badass and I'm just killing it. looks like your knees hurt <laughs> yeah actually last game I heard it and it feels a little loose the medial uh, MCL yeah I feel like I need to start wearing a knee brace like an old woman. Oh.